It's the NBA on 2K Sports. It's Dallas facing the home team. Now, a look at Dallas's starting lineup. Bell is out there with Nash. Then there's Finley. Then there's Nowitzki. And it's LaFrance in at the five down low. The offensive rebound. And the bucket counts. He's on his way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three-point play. If you battle for the offensive rebound and come up with it, you're guaranteed a high-quality shot on a follow just like he got there. Nash kicks to Bell. Nowitzki with a screen on Jordan. Jordan again. Bell. Nowitzki a screen. Shot clock at five. Nash's shot is in. He could have forced a tough inside shot, but made a terrific kick out to find the open jumper instead. Anthony kicks to Bosch. Makes it off the glass. Bosch has got five now. I tell you what, guys, it's going to be a tough day on this defense if he's got the A game rolling tonight. Here's Nowitzki. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Oh, that is just weak defense there. I'm pretty sure that was not the plan to give him those kind of baskets at the hoop. solid right off the bat it really has and they've created a lot of high percentage shots in the paint here already now here's Nash Nowitzki up top Nash the pass to Finland Nowitzki dishes to Nash shot clock at six Not loose well there was no hand in his face right there I thought that down. Dallas with the ball. It's a three-point game. Bell with it. He's picked up by Kidd. That evens the score. Nash has got five. They really can't allow him too many open looks like that. I mean, that's just inviting trouble. Anthony kicks to DeRozan. Here's Kidd. The shot misses. And it's Dallas the other way. Quarter of basketball, just over two and a half minutes play. Pass to Finley. And the go ahead bucket, no good. I guess even he has to this one of those once in a while. Clearly, he's one of the best there is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. 
Here's Nash. He has five. Nowitzki a screen. Nash the pass to Nowitzki. Misfires after coming off the pitch. And DeRozan kicks to Kidd. Bosch in the post. Pulls it up. It's good from inside. Bosch has got seven. Those are the kind of nice inside looks they've gotten in the first half here. And I think they should continue to work the ball down low, Clark. It's really going to free up their outside shooting. Now here's Nowitzki. Again, the miss by Nowitzki. more of those than he misses when he's got that much room. That's good from DeMar DeRozan. Both teams will make substitutions. Both free throws good from DeRozan. Here's Johnson. The dish to Nahara. Over to the wing. And he gets the bucket. Well, that, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of tricks up his sleeve. DeRozan, the shot is off. Now Dallas takes it the other way. Van Axel kicks to Johnson. And fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. And really the defense fouling there to prevent the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. It is. I mean, no reason to back off and give him the layup. Much better off making him go to the line. And both free throws good for Johnson. 129 left in the first quarter. Here's DeRozan. Lopez a screen. And DeRozan, here we go, can't throw it down with one hand. You rarely see him missing down. But the defender was right in his face on that one. And it threw him off just enough. And here they come. Here's Honda Takumbo. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Yeah, easy call. Yeah, you can hear the smack all the way over here where we are. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Jason Kidd's checked in for DeMar DeRozan. All three throws good from Anadokounmpo. George against Van Exel. Nowitzki a screen. 52 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Dallas, no good that time either. Six feet out. And good, and it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Another bucket in the paint. That's something they just have not been able to stop today. Yeah, the defense is all about disrupting timing and spacing, and, and what they've got going right now is not getting it done. Now, here's Van Exel. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Oh! And with that speed, once he took off, the D just had no chance of getting back. Well, I think they did the right thing. I mean, just give up the two points and move forward. Hey, discretion is the better part of valor sometimes. Write that one down, game players. Discretion is the better part of valor. That was a nice replay brought to you by Kia. Here is Nahara. No good on the buzzer beater. dividends for them through the first excellent hustle and you know the coach has to be pleased with that effort at the defensive end on the floor for Dallas we've got Bradley Nash out there with Van Axel and there's Finley and it's LaFrance in it the four slot Bradley kicks to Nash and stolen by Cousins and now it's a double digit lead that's the third bucket in a row from the paint 
This defense needs to clog those lanes in the middle much more effectively. You just cannot allow the offense to have that quality of a look each and every possession. Nice work on the inside. Hard to get that one up and over the big fella. Well, it's not supposed to be easy down there, and a little artistry on the inside helped him make it happen. Now, here's Bosch, and he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Bosch has got nine. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now, Greg. They've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Nash, the pass to Finley. Dallas moving the ball around. Lock it four. Here's LaFrance. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Yeah, it's such a sweet three-point stroke there, and it can really open things up inside because as good as he shoots it, it forces the opposing bigs to have to step out on the perimeter. Aja Bell, he's checked in for Dallas. Kid dishes to Bosch. Back to Kid. It's tipped. Tries again. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Now, here's Nash. He has seven. Shots good. I, I love the ball movement there. He put that on a silver platter. Just served him up. To the paint. Double team on Bosch. Yes, once again, it remains perfect. Six attempts and six hits. He's a big reason why they have the lead right now. He's made all of his field goal attempts thus far and remains hot from the floor. And here's Bell. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Back to Nash. Here's the screen. That three off the mark. Not able to find it here in the second. He's off stride and off track just a bit after that one he had early. Stripped it away. Out in his own on the break. And Finley gets it to go. Yeah, they've raised their shooting percentage in this quarter, and they're starting to get on track. And they're starting to heat up is what they're doing. They're on fire. I mean, that's what they need to climb back into this game. Now, here's Jordan. Kid kicks to Cousins. And it's a defensive three-second violation. And so he hits the technical free throw. Dallas making a switch here. Nowitzki's checked in. Here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. DeRozan against Bell. Five on the clock. Three-pointer. Kid. Good. Kid's got six. Dallas trails by 12. with there's a screen to the wing right side it's Nash with the drive that is good nine points in the game so far they've had assists now on their last three baskets and it's not just their passing but also the body movement off the ball that's created a lot of those opportunities I love his shot selection today. He set the bar for the rest of the team. Here's Nowitzki. Takes a big height bounce and goes in. Timely passing leads to assists, and that's been the recipe for success. Everybody on the same page, completely in sync. Tremendous communication and awareness. Well, uh, you know, they're in the lead, but he's still been frustrated from an offensive standpoint. And Nash, here we go. Weiner. And LaFrance gets it to go. Shooting much better here in the second quarter. Yes, very, very impressed with how much more alive they look here to get back in. A different look for Dallas. Eduardo Nahara checked in for Finley. Van Exel comes in for Raja Bell. And it's Johnson in for Steve Nash. Now here's Johnson. To the wing right side. 
Mannix off target from three-point range. So that defense went from four to no defense at all. And when he's open like that, you don't see him miss those looks very often. Here's Johnson following the score by DeMar DeRozan. Johnson kicks to Van Axel. Fifty-nine seconds left in the first half. Dishes it to Johnson. Nice D from DeRozan. That is good. Six points here for George. And just a little bit ragged defensively there, Clark. Forty-six seconds left now here in the second. Johnson outside, kicks it to Van Exel. Nowitzki a screen. And DeMar DeRozan pulls it down. And, and, and typically he has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure on that possession. Clearly they've been the hotter team here in the first half. Well, they've been grit and grind working for those high percentage shots, and quite honestly, it's paid off for them. One second separating the shot clock and game clock. with the screen on George. Nowitzki left side. Connects from three-point range. Nowitzki's got five points now in the quarter. And they're just raining threes on both ends. Boy, I love the answer. You come at me with the three, I'm coming right back with my own triple. And so we wrap up the first half. now it's been a one team show so far we'll see if that changes here in the third what a great game for Bosch in this one he's got 16 points and he's still working hard for those rebounds and that's what he has to do solid effort on the glass can make such a huge difference on most nights Jason Kidd is out there with Jordan then there's Chris Bosch then it's Anthony and it's DeRozan in at the three -seat. so that's who Rick Carlisle starts the second half with for Nellis, they have been perfect at the line so far, albeit just two for two. Free throw good, Nowitzki. Two shots. Good on both. We're seeing today what makes him one of the best free throw shooters among the league's big men. Beautiful stroke. For three, Kidd. That's in there. Anthony with the assist. Anthony's got three assists in the game. against Kidd. Nash kicks to Nowitzki. Kidd against Nash. Back to Nowitzki. Just four to shoot. Unloads from 13. And Finley gets it to go. And when he breaks out the crossover, you can be sure he's going to leave somebody in his way. That's terrific defense right there to prevent from converting in close. Now, here is Bell. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game for him. DeRozan passes to Anthony. Al Finley. Nowitzki with the screen on Kidd. And Nash, here we go. That one is good. He's only missed one shot of his six taken on the floor. Really aggressive play there, taking it to the rack against the big shot. You know, Greg, 
aggressiveness is really the only option when you're on the wrong side of the size equation. The first free throw is good. DeMarcus Cousins, he's checked in for DeMar DeRozan. And Dallas with a change here, too. Bradley's checked in. Chris Bosh really making a difference here. And he's getting to the rack all game, and if they can't do a better job of keeping him out of the paint, they're in for a long night. Dallas trails by 10. That's good from Nowitzki on the assist by Nash. Nash has got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Kidd kicks to Anthony. And that one's good. Anthony's got four points in the quarter. Almost uncontested. I mean, it's nice to be able to add to the lead without having to really work for it. Nash outside. Passes to Finley. Out to the right wing. Here's Nowitzki. It's rebounded by Bosch. Bosch has got two rebounds so far in the game. Superb playmaking from Kidd with that dish right there. A little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the third. Now here's Nash. He's got 11. He feeds it to Bell. He dishes it to Nowitzki. Five to shoot. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. It's on DeMarcus Cousins. For Dallas, they have looked good at the line tonight. They're perfect in four attempts. Nowitzki has been playing really well. He has 14 points, and he's put one three-pointer on the board. You know what, though, Clark? It wouldn't be a bad idea going forward to try to let him do a little more damage from beyond the arc. And the rebound goes to Nash. Dallas trails by 10. Here's Finley. Rebound by DeMarcus Cousins. The drive by Jordan. Offensive rebound. No good for Bosch. Here's Dallas. Dishes to Bradley. Nash again. Skid. Novitsky is screen. Out to the right wing. Dallas needs to get off a shot. Nash outside. Good defense by Kidd. The drive by Jordan. And he gets it to go. Jordan's got eight points. Jordan, he's one of the best in the league at that. Even with just a tiny sliver, he always seems to find a way to get it up and in. Outside Brent. Now the pass to Finley. Back to Bradley. He kicks it to Bell. Fires from deep. The shot no good. Well, they're fortunate. Defense is taking a big chance, leaving him that wide open behind the arc. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. And he knocks down the first one. A different look for Dallas. Eduardo Nahara checked in for Finley. Van Exel comes in for Raja Bell. And it's Johnson in for Steve Nash. Clark, they've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a little bit of cotton mouth here. Dry spell for sure. Van Exel kicks to Johnson. Takes it from 10. A tad short, but it's good off the front iron. You know what? That's what you like to see. A perfect pass leading him right into the shot. Didn't even have to break strike. That's as forceful a finish as you're ever going to see out of this guy. Well, gee, it adds now to their lead in spectacular fashion. And you know, that lead's only going to grow if they're not prepared to defend a little more staunchly than that. Yeah, can't be pleased with all these easy looks. They continue to give up there in the paint. No, I'm sure he's not, Greg. I mean, their defense is showing a lot of holes, especially down low. That's unacceptable. DeMar DeRozan, he's checked in for Michael Jordan. To the middle, stolen by George. Here's Honda Takumbo. Marvelous lead pass, and he throws it down. A signature slam right there from the big fella. How many of those have we seen before? Johnson, the pass to Nahara. 
Van Exel against George. Van Exel dishes to Nahara. Just five to shoot. Back to Van Exel. Shoots. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. They've shown effort and aggression in the paint right from the tip. Their rebounding edge is impressive. And they're giving themselves extra possession and have taken advantage of it. And that's critical. You can shoot a few lesser percentage if you're getting more opportunities at the rim. Van Exel with a screen on DeRozan. Johnson kicks to Van Exel. There's a good screen. And it's sent back by Howard. And so the ball out of bounds. Howard touched it last. Out of bounds. Dallas touched the ball. We've got 13 seconds left in the third. Outside DeRozan. Offline with his three. Here's Van Exel. It's off. And we're getting underway here in the. On the floor for Dallas, we've got Nash. Nowitzki is out there with Eduardo Nahara. Then there's Bell, and it's LaFrance in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Here's Anthony, and a strong finish with two hands. Hey, haven't we seen that a few times today, guys? I mean, their defense has got to have a little bit more toughness about it. Dallas trails by 20. Here is Bell. It's Nowitzki, top of the key. Great look, but off the mark. And the dunk to finish it off. A uh, beauty. Elevates and powers in the one hand. Ah, uh, textbook. Yeah, and I'm glad, guys, he doesn't go overboard on that one and get a little too fancy. Taken away by Anthony. DeRozan. George passes to Bosch. Double team on Bosch. He was all alone on that one. 11 points for Paul George. And the lead continues to increase. They are just playing flawless basketball at both ends. Greg, I can't identify an area where this team has underperformed. I mean, they've been five-star in every category. Here is Bell. Paul George making his last shot. No good from Bell. Nash against Bosch. Lopez up top. Shot. I boast. Good. It's Bosch picking up the assist. And that set them apart today, guys. Their success with the mid range. Simply taking advantage of what the defense has given them, and they've really made the most of it. Here's LaFrance. Novinsky gets a wide open look, drills it from outside. Nowitzki's got nine points here in the second half. Boy, I tell you what, he loves getting looks like that from the three-point line. No one near him. That's a warm-up jumper for him. Yeah, it looks like he saw some things out there that, that need to be adjusted, and it's going to take a break here and talk it over. Hey, you know, coaches sometimes need a break in the action to rethink and retool a bit. Anytime you, you're in that situation, it makes sense to use the timeout. Dallas making a switch here. Finley's checked in. Now Bell following the three-point attempt by Jason Kidd. And here's Bell out left to the wing. And here's Nash outside. They grab their own miss. And he gets it to go. Guys, he's actually indefatigable. He never gives in, never gives up on a play. And that's what it takes to be a great offensive rebounder. You've got to be relentless. Now here's Anthony, and that's collected by Nowitzki. Here's Finley, DeRozan defending, taken away by Kidd. And DeRozan.
goes and kicks to Anthony. And it's good. Caught through contact. It's the shot. He'll go to the free throw line. Mello having a terrific game. Ten points, and he's done a good job distributing the ball as well. And you can't really place a value on what that means to a team. His passing has really helped their cause. And Bell kicks to Finley. The feed now to Nash. Fires from deep. Nash with another miss. He's not exactly striking them from deep. He had one three ball in the first half. Still bageled in the second. Anthony dishes to Jordan. From outside, off the mark. Nowitzki with the screen on Kidd. Nash drives in. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact and he'll shoot two. And the first one at the line is good. Oh, free throws good from Nash. Yeah, I like that they haven't lost their aggressiveness here in the second despite being down. That's exactly when you need to be aggressive, Greg. You know that. I mean, another good job, though, of drawing contact and getting to the free throw line. Kid, no good. Bell passes to Nash. Here's Finley. Nowitzki outside. Shot clock at six. Shot high post. Gets to the front of the rim and out. Not really necessary with nobody on you. I mean, why put yourself off balance on that shot when you're wide open? Back to Anthony. Outside by. Anthony. Gets to DeRozan. Here's the three. The shot by Anthony. No good. Feeds to Nowitzki. Some nice passing here by Dallas. Here's LaFrance. Dallas again missing. Mark, one thing we've seen from these guys is excellent ball movement. And you love to see that, Kevin. I mean, I love watching unselfish play, and I know Greg enjoys that too. No doubt about it. It's fun to watch the way they're operating as a team right now. They are all in sync. And Jason Kidd picks up the foul. That's his first foul. Both teams will make substitutions. There's 117 left to play here in the fourth. Bradley dishes to Nowitzki. Right side, Jones. Nowitzki with the screen on Kidd. Jones lands soft on the front of the rim and drops. You can't afford to get him that kind of a look. Well, you know, he came off a good screen, but still, as a defender, you've got to do a better job of fighting over and through that. Now here's Kidd. Pass to Jefferson. From 17 feet out, that drops. Oh, Terrific run to seal the deal. Yeah, and now let's just keep an eye on how much longer they keep the foot on the accelerator. Here's Jones. At the elbow, it's Brantley. Great touch on the 16-footer. Yeah, it's just a smart shot taking advantage of the mismatch. Well, with a stroke like that and the height advantage as well, the mid-range J is almost a gimmick. Oh, terrific way to finish that move there, going to the basket. Down low, here's Nowitzki. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. And he makes the first. He makes one of two that time. They are enjoying the commanding lead. And it really gives them the opportunity to give their starters a rest. Always critical when you get ready for that home stretch. Here's Jones, and it's sent back by George. Outside kid jacks up a three. That doesn't go either for George. So the home crowd treated to a win. It was a tale of two teams tonight. One that was in total control, operating flawlessly. And Clark, the other, just searching for answers that they could never find. Well, I think these fans, too, Kevin, gave their team a tremendous lift. I mean, they never gave up on it. From the opening tip until the end of the game, they were in it. And that certainly helped this crew get to the W. And that'll do it, folks. 
For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports as Jordan presents our player of the game, Chris Bosh.
starting group for the visitors. DeRozan out there with Anthony, and it's Michael Jordan. Then there's Chris Bosh, and it's Kidd in at the one spot. Shot from the low block, and Jordan with the nice inside bucket. Cleveland with the ball. Price outside. On the wing, Williams. Nance outside. And the shot is good, dropping in off the front of the rim. I don't know. Maybe they're still working out the kinks on D because that clearly was a breakdown. Now here's Kidd. Anthony down low. Working on William. There was just enough defensive pressure to get him off balance and cause that shot to go awry. Here's Elo. Bosch grabs the miss. The defense there got away with a major lapse. It's rebounded by Cleveland. And you... you can see the defenders afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. Did not seem happy about how things are going on right now. And he maybe wants to make some changes. Yeah, I agree. I mean, just was not comfortable with the way things were set up at that particular time. And in that case, I think it's the right thing to do. That's a two from Kidd. Not wasting any time and taking the shot and knocking it down. And we're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. Pass to Nance. With the fadeaway. DeMar DeRozan grabs the board. On defense, Cleveland. The drive by Jordan. And here's Kidd from the arc. Here's Anthony. Hangs. He takes it up and lays it in. Anthony's got his first points in this one. And so it's Cleveland with it. Four-point game. Pass to Williams. And Anthony sends it back. Really just struggling here in the first few minutes. Five and ten. With only one fall. That's a quick bucket there. Solid in transition. Well, you know, he loves the chance to get out and run, and we could see right there why he does. It's been a slow start here for Cleveland. 
They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Sure could, Kev. I mean, too many empty trips. They need some points. Jordan is just... The price, five on the clock for three, and that one's good. Price has got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. That's a two from Kidd. It's good, only a few seconds into the shot clock. First quarter of play, we're about three minutes in. There's the dish to Nance. Back to Elo. Price again. Kid. Jordy with the three nine kid. Here's Price, and that one off the back of the rim and in. <laughs> wow, risky shot there, size wise, but the incredible skill that he possesses allows that one to go. Well, the quick high release negated any height disadvantage he had right there. And it's DeRozan missing. That's one he knows he should have drained. Jordy with a screen on Jordan. Nance with it. Now guarded by DeRozan. Price kicks to Doherty. It's stolen by Anthony. Here's DeRozan. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle on a lot of contact. Here. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. A big group substitution here for Cleveland. Mokeski's checked in for Doherty. Rollins comes in for Williams. Reggie Williams, he's checked in for Nance. And Steve Kerr is subbed in for Mark Price. I didn't expect that result when he stepped up there. I'll bet he didn't either. As good a foul shooter as he is. That one goes. Really crisp, intelligent passing to make that basket possible. Anthony. That's tipped. On the wing, Williams. The feed to Kirk. On the wing, Eli. They set the pick. It's six. Kerr, the pass to Rollins. Let's it fly. And he misses the go-ahead basket. The shot's there for him, and he's got to take it. I don't care if he doesn't convert. That's a shot he has to continue to take. The one-hand slam is so sweet when it's his hand doing the slam. Oh, yeah, he is so smooth, even on a power finish like that. And really, that's... What makes him unique? That combination of power and polish. Elo can't hit. Elo's gone. One of three shooting so far. It's deflected. Takes it from 10. That one a little long. Elo again. George. Kicks. Rosen from downtown. That ball's nice feed that time from George. DeRozan's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. And DeMar DeRozan pulls it down. Yeah, they got that one, but early on, it's it's really been a struggle for them to secure that defensive back rule. And because it's still early, I wouldn't read too much into it. There's still a lot of game left. Now Williams. Rollins with a screen on Anthony. There's Williams with the three, and it would have counted had it fallen, but it's Ladies and gentlemen, the game's team. All right, the second quarter beginning in just a moment. And looking at what we've seen so far, guys, from the visiting team, what do you think? I tell you what, defensively, they have been in tune with one another as intense as I've seen. Yeah, nice job helping out on the rotations and drives, doing really good work at the defensive end. Price is out. There with Kerr, and it's Nance, then it's Williams, and it's Doherty in at the center, locking down the middle. That's the group for Cleveland going right now here in the second. And he came off that screen, and the D just didn't get over the top of it. Yep, weren't there in time enough to challenge, Greg. And when that's the case, you can mark those up for him. Howard set the pick for Kale. Score the basket is third after five shots. 
Hard to get that one off with the size difference there. That makes it a tough individual matchup for him, especially down low. Well, took on the big guys going in there and challenging them like he did. But boy, that was a nice job. Now here's Jordan. They lead by six, their biggest margin. Boy, he threw out some punishment with that two-hand throw down. And, and Clark, now's the time to do it. Continue to attack that rim. And we play just over a minute of basketball here in the second quarter. Price kicks to Williams. He dishes it to Nance. The price shoots Jordan with the rebound. Dishes at the kid out of bounds. Cleveland takes possession. And now approaching two minutes of action here in the second quarter. Clark, they've been looking out of sync offensively. You know what? A basket here would do a lot for their confidence. Williams a Taking a look at that jam. Beautiful. And that's how you make a steal count. Turn it into a quick slam at the other end. It was really a case. It looked like Greg Anthony right there, if I, if I can say so. It was really a case of a great defensive play triggering some instant offense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember GA as an irritant. And this guy, much like Greg, creating havoc out there. And that replay sponsored by Kia, the Kia Slam Cam giving us a great look at that one. Kerr with it. He hasn't scored yet. That I'm sure will change. Shot on the wing. That's good. From Price, the assist by Kerr. Time out. You know, obviously, he, you know, there's some things out there he does not like and wants to talk it over. Well, Greg, you play and you um, envision yourself as a coach as well. So, you know, sometimes uh, you make some adjustments. You know, obviously, he knows how to finish with some flair. Here's Price, and it's blocked by Kidd. To the inside. And then Jordan slams it in. What an incredible run they're on right now. Offense as well as I've ever seen it play. Every single guy on their team with the absolute Midas magic touch shooting the lights out here. Price kicks to Doherty. Howard with the steal. Pushing it up, pushing it up. And again, it's Jason Kidd. Kidd's got six points in the quarter. Boy, I tell you what, nice little run here they're going on. And, and getting to the 10 has been the key. They're getting point-blank looks time and time again. Here's Price. And another miss by Cleveland. The shooting numbers just aren't there yet in the quarter. That's going to be over and back. Not watching for the line that time. Craig Elo checked in for Steve Kerr. Cleveland trails by 14. Inside, here's Williams. Power down after the assist. Let him into the lane. And if that doesn't get them fired up, guys, nothing will. Craig just with the talk to order. Now some high-flying annex to narrow the deficit. Tell you what, fellas, that could give them the energy boost they've been looking for. The drive by Jordan. Michael Jordan. A different look now for Cleveland. McKeskey's checked in for Dorton. Rollins comes in for Williams. And it's Williams in for Larry Nance. Price kicks to Williams. They set the pick. Rollins against Anthony. Back to Williams. The timely screen gave him a step, and he took it all the way. Very well executed pick to give him all kinds of space to get that one off. Lopez, boom, he jams it straight down. And very little fight put up by the defense as he made his way to the bucket for the jam. They did seem to take the cautious approach, Greg, when it came to defending that one. You're right. And guys, it's not the time for caution now. I mean, they've got to be aggressive and take some risk to see if they can cut that lead down. How about the screen that frees him up, though, for the jumper? 
And stolen by Williams. Here's Rollins. Elo with it. George picks him up. We've got 118 left in the second quarter. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Price, and Anthony sends it back. Left side, Kid, And DeMar DeRozan, the bucket on the assist by Kid. Kidd's got three assists in the game. Timeout called Cleveland. And as the coaches go to the clipboard to outline their strategy during the timeout, the players getting a chance to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's key to staying fresh all the way to the final whistle. And Kevin, it really is. And every one of these players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially uh, towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. Tacks a few more points onto their lead with the town hall. Ah, that's bringing it down hard, Clark. Yes, sir. The town hard, yes, my sir. Yes, <laughs> Symbolic sir. there as well of the effort here tonight. Williams passes to McKeskey. He feeds it to Elo. Cleveland moving it around. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. Goes up at the stripe. And that one comes up a bit short. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. And what I like about it, Greg, it's been a physical brand of basketball. It's had a little sandpaper element to it. Gritty and, and rough. But that's how you win games. Here's Price. It's good, and he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play chance here. He's getting his first free-throw attempt of the game here. And that one falls for Price. And DeRozan kicks to Lopez. Just three on the clock. He lays it in. Lopez has got four points now in the quarter. Another gap in the defense found there, and they've really had their number today. And that concludes the first half. Shervenez Vesta. They lead by 13. And we'll be back right after halftime for the start of the third quarter. We'll see you in a bit. back we begin our second half so far not a tightly contested game guys but you know anything can happen well how about jason kidd in this one? he has 12 points and there's a nice number in his assist column as well he, it really has been clark he's created a lot of open looks for his teammates very unselfish play from him today all fueled up and ready to go let's reset the lineups courtesy of gatorade for the second half of basketball chris bosh is out there with anthony then it's jason kidd then it's michael jordan and it's DeRozan in at the three slot and he's good on the second now here's kidd and lots of contact there. Missing the shot. He'll shoot two. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. And the first one drops. Both free throws good from Kidd. Here is Price. Outside Williams. Nance outside. Pass to Elo. Feeds it to Darty. Six on the shot clock. Shot misses. Nice D from Bosch. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Yeah, double digit advantage on the scoreboard. 
they've taken the initiative. They've played, I think, with more purpose so far. Cleveland trails by 16. Williams, a screen on kid. Price kicks to Doherty. Baj with some nice D. Inside, it's tipped. Jordan dishes to Anthony. And there's the pass to Kidd. Back to Anthony. Fires it up. The shot will not go. And Cleveland the other way now. Elo kicks to Price. Outside Williams. There's the screen. Bosch against Nix. Doherty the screen. Pass to Price. Let's the three fly. Once again off the mark by Cleveland. They have yet to hit a shot. A real slow start here in the second half. Mark, they're looking now at a sizable deficit. Yeah, you know, they've got a lot of work ahead of them, but no reason to give up hope right now. Yeah, definitely not, guys. Not with all the time that's still left in this game. That's a big donut, folks, here. Oh! oh. <laughs> and I like how he puts himself in position there to finish on the break. Yeah, you know, that's what we call seeing and feeling the game. Excellent read of how that play was going to develop and where the ball was going. That's stuff that you oftentimes can't teach, Greg. And that last replay courtesy of Kia. You know, he just, like every other coach, can't stand when the defense gives up points on the inside. And, boy, are they struggling in there. Yeah, well, they're getting pummeled in there. So you've got to figure out a way to make some adjustments to try to change that around. And that's why he needed the timeout. Kerr's checked in for Cleveland. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Cleveland shooting their fourth and fifth shots at the foul line in the game. John Williams. First free throw is good. Two shots. So he gets them both. A little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the third. Kerr against Kidd. Bosch sets the pick for Kidd. And a wide open look for Jordan. Good, and it's Bosch picking up the assist. And that's 17 points for Michael Jordan. Cleveland trails by 19. Doherty the screen. Kerr with it. He's picked up by Kidd. Elo the pass to Williams. Stolen by Bosch. It's deflected and stolen by Doherty. And the jam by Larry Nance. Oh, quick hands <laughs> on the steal and then just mad hops on the slam. Great sequence for them defensively and Clark offensively. Well, one usually leads to the other, Kevin. That's just good, aggressive, attacking basketball at both ends. Cleveland with the ball. Kirk kicks to Nance. Doherty against Howard. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. He had a defender all over. Greg, he got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. So one for two that time at the stripe. Yeah, I like that they haven't lost their aggressiveness here in the second, despite being down. That's exactly when you need to be aggressive, Greg. You know that. I mean, another good job, though, of drawing contact and getting to the free throw line. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Jordy with the screen on Jordan. Here's Nance. Once again off the mark by Cleveland. Their rebounding has been off the charts today, guys. Reason number one, this game is out of hand. Exactly, Clark. Their lead is not surprising given their advantage on the backboard. How about Michael Jordan in this one? He's got 19 points, and he's chalked up one three-pointer on the day as well. And, Clark, I'm sure that won't be the last one. A lot of times, he can get hot and stay hot from beyond. Catching up on the changes for Cleveland. Rollins comes in for Williams, and it's Williams in for Elo. Nance outside. Williams kicks to Doherty. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Williams. Doherty's got four points now in the quarter. To the inside. Here's Howard. But he stays with it. Jordan, he's open. 
They get it back. Goes up again. And stolen by Doherty. Up top, Kerr. Started by Jordan. And there's the call on Howard. That's his third foul of the game. And Cleveland making a change here. Markeski's checked in. The visitors on defense. That was perfectly designed, Kevin. An easy dunk on that inbounds play. Nance has gone two for four so far here tonight. The drive by Jordan. Oh, took the contact and tried to throw it down over the top. But instead, he'll shoot free throws. He's gone two for two at the line so far. Michael Jordan. Two shots. And so Jordan nails both of them. And they're doing a better job of working themselves to the line here in the second half. This is how you do it. That's exactly how you do it. Defender pressing up on you, you press right back. Got a piece of it. Stolen by George. And now, here comes Anadokounmpo leading the break. Jefferson dishes to Lopez. And three from Jordan. Jordan with another miss. Cleveland trails by 20. Yeah, the defender all over. Greg, he got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. For Cleveland, they have gone 5 of 7 from the free throw line in the game. The first free throw is good. Art Price, he's checked in for Cleveland. And Williams drops them both. There's 48 seconds left to play in the third. Here's DeRozan. The step back jumper is good. DeRozan's got seven points. And he could be the guy to put this game out of reach. Price kicks to Nance. Let's it go from 11. Antetokounmpo pulls it in. Nance has gone two of five from the floor. It's DeRozan with the drive. Can't get it to go. Nance with some nice D. And so here's Cleveland. And here's Price. 12 points for him. Pass to Williams. From deep. And that's not going to go. The three quarters of play all in the books. And this one all but... Again, with the fourth quarter, might not come down to the wire, but you never know. I've got Doherty. Price is out there with Elo. Then there's Larry Nance. And it's Williams at the four spot. That's the five for Cleveland right now. Price against Kidd. Doherty with the screen on Kidd. Here's Price, and it's sent back by Howard. Here's the break, and they're running. Here's Anthony. That's good. And so Howard with the assist. And that's now six points for Carmelo Anthony. Cleveland with the ball. Price outside. Doherty, the screen. And they call over the back here. Too much contest. You know, right call. Gave the officials no choice there. I mean, they've got to make that call over the back. Yeah. I mean, he went chest first into the man in front of him. My goodness. I'm not an official, and I could have gotten that one right. Michael Jordan is checked in for Dwight Howard. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Price outside. The dish to Doherty. And yes, sir, that one drops. I think they need to get much more disruptive defensively. They can't just keep allowing these easy baskets. That's got to be job number one right now. Nothing easy on the inside. We're seeing the shots start to fall for them now. Yeah, exactly. I mean, this has been an extremely efficient second half for them up to this point. Price kicks to Doherty. That's another one for him. It is fifth in just seven shots. You know, if you're only looking at the way he's played offensively, you think his team would have the lead. Price against Kidd. Here's Anthony. Drops it in from 11 feet. Anthony's got six here in this quarter. He's played an important role in their offense today, guys. Without him, they may not be in the lead. 
We've seen Michael Jordan really having a great game. He's in one heck of a groove with the score. They're going to talk it over and try to figure out how to slow him down. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. There's the feed to Darty. Back to Price. And that one hits back iron. Been a real difficult game for him offensively, and it's costly. Wash kicks to Jordan. The shot. The shot is off. And Cleveland the other way now. Elo outside. Doherty the screen. Fires from 18. Jordan with the rebound. Jordan's got three rebounds so far in the game. Here's to Rosen, and there's a nice one-handed slam. I like the fact that he led his teammate right to the ideal spot. You don't always throw it to your teammate. You throw it to where he needs to be. On the wing, Williams. Doherty, the screen. Nance dishes to Elo. There's the pick. Kicks to Doherty. Back to Elo, six to shoot, and he gets it to go. Nice pass. He got the ball right into his teammate's shooting pocket, on time and on target. Kid passes to Anthony. And the basket good. Nice pass there to set that bucket up. And that's 10 of their last 12 points that have come off assists. Dishes it to Darty. Bosch grabs the miss. Bosch has got his third rebound on the night. And DeRozan kicks to Jordan. The shot no good. Williams with the defensive effort. Elo against Jordan. Passes to Nance. Williams a screen. Elo outside. Price against DeRozan. Elo dishes to Darty. The three. And it's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. A different look now for Cleveland. Davis comes in for Larry Nance. And Steve Kerr is subbed in for Mark Price. Wall passes to Jordan. That's good. And so Wall with the assist. 26 points for Jordan. Excellent ball movement there, guys. And that's keyed this run. Passing it with purpose, the D hasn't been able to keep up. Jordan against Elo, and he gets it to go. He was the first one to react to that miss. Excellent anticipation on his part. A hustle play on the putback by him. Out of bounds, Cleveland takes possession. That's a major mental mistake. I mean, there's no other way for me to describe it. He didn't know where he was on the court. That's a that's a that's a basic fundamental. You have to be alert to where you are. Catching up on the changes for Cleveland. Mokeski's checked in for Doherty. Rollins comes in for Williams. And it's Williams in for Elo. Fires from the line. It's rebounded by John Wall. Well, that's an excellent challenge right there. Good job contesting that shot by the defender. Out of bounds, Cleveland takes possession. Boy, did they ever make a mess out of that one. A terrible turnover. 124 left in the fourth quarter. Kerr kicks to Williams. There's the pass to McKeskey. Davis against Zanadokounmpo. Here's Kerr, and it's blocked by Jordan. Here's Bilar. He's guarded by Williams. And the bucket counts, and he's on his way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three-point play. And he just big boyed it right there. The height advantage he's got down low, really difficult for them to defend. Here's the screen. Pass to McKesson. 46 seconds left in the game. Rollins the pass to Williams. Alley-oop try. It's deflected, and it's going to go the other way. Al Jefferson's checked in for Jordan. There's 37 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Outside for George. He 
He dishes it to Jefferson. A rim-rattling two-handed jam. And they're not finished just yet. They're going to make sure about this win. Yeah, not taking any chances, Greg. This is how you close a game out. Textbook. Williams against George. And Williams, here we go. And that one falls for Williams. Reggie Williams. Two shots. And Williams drops them both. Now Wall. Pass to Bolar. And good, coming off the assist by Wall. And the lead continues to increase. They are just playing flawless basketball at both ends. Greg, I can't identify an area where this team has underperformed. I mean, they've been five-star in every category. And so it's a victory for the road team in this one. This one was over well before the final buzzer. The fans were waiting.